Good to be with you again, uh, my senior Ken, again with our weekly check-in, continuing our journey into our wonderful Catholic faith. And I hope uh, you're praying every day. But I also want to give you something else to do in your Catholic home. Every year, I know, don't you celebrate your birthday? We look forward to that, and it's a wonderful time. Uh, moms and dads, they celebrate their anniversaries. Or well, they better not forget, right? <laughs> Set aside that day to remember on the moment when they were married. Well, I'm going to suggest to you that you can also celebrate your sacrament days. And this will give you a little bit of homework. You're baptized? Find out what day you were baptized. I'm going to encourage you to celebrate your baptism day every year. That would be a wonderful thing to do. That's not a big, a big celebration. Nothing more than just remembering that and saying a special prayer. Uh, maybe you could have a special seat at the dinner table, uh, but to celebrate your baptism day. For those that made communion, <clears throat> wouldn't it be wonderful to celebrate the day of your first Holy Communion? Maybe talk mom and dad into going out to dinner uh, for a special place, because that is the day of your first Holy Communion. If you do that every year, remind you of how special that is. And of course, uh, you get older and you celebrate your confirmation. That's another day you can celebrate your confirmation day, your Holy Spirit day. So it'd be wonderful to do those things every year. It reminds us of those moments, and it reminds us uh, of how special our Catholic faith is. So just a little suggestion. And maybe if you're very clever, maybe you can get a little gift out of it too on the side. Celebrate your sacrament days. Uh, that would be a wonderful thing to do. But one of the things that we receive in those sacraments is a beautiful gift that God gives to us. And we call it grace. Grace is God's life that he gives to us. And what is that life? Uh, well, when you think about it, uh, when we're with somebody that we enjoy being with, they give us their life by their joy, <clears throat> their interest in us, the things that we love about them. Being together with them, we kind of like pick up their energy. We pick up their happiness. That's kind of like a sharing of their life with us. And God does the same thing to us. He gave us his life in Jesus, dying on the cross, but he gives us that grace to us through the sacraments. The sacraments is God's grace given to us, God's life given to us. And the more grace we get, the stronger we get, the happier we get, the better we become. And each of the sacraments, in a special way, give us that grace. Uh, so celebrate your sacrament days uh, and know that through them you receive a special gift from God, the gift of God's life, what we call grace. God bless. See you next time.